Well, right now, I want to reiterate the school system is reporting that all students are safe. Right now, both Dinwiddie Middle and High Schools are on lockdown. Sources telling us that this call came into the Dinwiddie dispatch system within the past hour. Reporting of a possible armed intruder inside the school behind me here. Check out the scene here. You can see the Dinwiddie County Sheriff's Office blocking the entrance here. Also, state police, fire and EMS, as well as canines here at the school. You can also see a concerned parent begin pulling up, officials stopping them from getting any closer than this location. Sources telling us students and staff are on something called an intruder alert. So if you are a parent or a Dinwiddie student, you most likely received a robo call this morning sent from the school system saying a possible intruder here at Dinwiddie High School. Students are safe, however. As far as CBS 6 is aware, there is no reported injuries as well uh, here at Dinwiddie High School or the middle school after there was report of an armed intruder. But we do know right now police inside Dinwiddie High School and middle school searching for a potential gunman. So that is unconfirmed at this time, but we will stay on the scene. We'll have any other updates for you during this newscast. Working for you in Dinwiddie, I'm Brendan King, CBS 6 News. All right, thank you very much, Brendan. And just to give you an idea of what we're talking about, um, Dinwiddie High School and Middle School are basically across the street from each other, and both schools, again, on lockdown at this point. A uh, robocall went out to parents to indicate that the students were all safe. We've been getting a lot of calls here at the CBS 6 newsroom. Uh, parents worried, parents asking what's going on. So at this point, uh, the lockdown continues. All students are safe, and we are monitoring the situation, and we'll continue to bring you updates here on the air. So stay with us on the air and online for the latest on this story at WTVR.com. We also have the very latest on that possible armed intruder at the high school. Just an alert call went into police this morning and we'll of course continue to follow the story throughout this next half hour for